Just want to talk to you today about something I've, I've decided to change up with the uh, fishing channel, the YouTube channel. Now, as you know, it was uh, DB Kayak Fishing um, for the last couple of years. And even though predominantly I do kayak fish, um, I do like to do other stuff as well, like shore fishing and a little bit of um, like predatory fishing, walking around reservoirs and lakes and that type of thing, and rivers and... Um, so, you know, DB kayak fishing kind of lent itself to one thing, but, um, and also there's, there's quite a few DBs out there. You all, you all know the successful DBs that are out there in, in, in the sort of fishing fraternity, but I've decided to change, um, the channel name to, uh, target fishing. Um, just because I was messing about with designs of, of different logos and, and looking on YouTube, there wasn't that many, many um, kind of YouTube channels specifically like with Target in the title, i.e. fishing channels. So I've changed the name to Target Fishing and um, hope to be producing some more videos that are better, bigger, better than, um, than what I've done before. So stick with us and um, it's just a name change and that's it but it will still be the same sort of content but I'm hoping to um, hoping to, to to get a bit better with the editing and, and that type of thing as well so um, yeah the, the names been changed from DB kayak fishing to target fishing cheers guys stay tuned hi guys so this is the first video um, for the new channel uh, target fishing so this this video really just touches on my targets for the year and what I'm planning to try and catch. Obviously we'll be doing loads of other videos. Can't resist fishing for bass as you know and I'll, I'll still fish for the, the gilt heads and other species. And But these, there's five species I wanna catch. So yeah, this is, um, this explains a little bit more about, about my aspirations for the year within the, the fishing fishing well. So yeah, thanks for watching. Hi guys, welcome back to Target Fishing. Um, today I want to talk about my target species for the year. Now in 2021 I sort of targeted gilthead breams probably a little bit too much. Um, I was down the west country a lot, down in uh, Kingsbridge Estuary. Um, and fishing the River Tamar as well a couple of times and you know, we got into them but didn't really get into any any sort of size one I think the biggest one was probably about two two and a half pounds something like that but um yeah so I'll still fish for them this year um, but I want to actively target you know one of the top of my list really is um, turbot so here in Sussex we've got no chance of actually targeting them specifically um, you might you might get lucky when drifting for place but to actually target them specifically off a kayak you, you you just can't do it even though the charter boats go out to said grounds from like Brighton and from Eastbourne we can't we can't access them grounds on a kayak it's just too far to paddle but in the West Country there's a couple of places that um, we can launch and we can paddle out to uh, you know a couple of mile and we are on the turbot grounds and these are you know these are decent turbot grounds as well um big fish you know not not the two three pounders we get down this end even if you're on a charter boat a double, or a near double off the kayak fishing in the west country so i'm, I'm going to be doing that this year i'm going to be targeting them um i'll be talking about the rigs that we're going to be using the tackle that we're going to be using we're in the turbot are in I know this because my good friend down in the West Country has actually caught a couple now. So hopefully, once this weather clears, um, we'll be able to get down there and, and just have a go for them. It'll be lovely. It'll be really, really nice coming out of winter now. And um, yeah, just be, be really, really good to have a go at them. Um, but we'll see. We'll see. Watch this space. Second species that I'd like to catch is... Um, going to be taupe so we want to target taupe so we can do that in Sussex that's not a problem we can actively target this fish probably from April onwards down at Pagham, Selsey, Bracklesham Bay those sort of areas they do hold fish throughout the summer so you know that's a viable option for us to to have a go down there 
off the kayak um, or even off the shore you know it doesn't have to be off the kayak but I think realistically to stay in a real good chance of getting into one and hooking one and uh, landing it then the place to go is uh, West Wales you know they're, they're pretty much as soon as as soon as April comes around then the, the, the taupe are in um, you've just got to get a nice weather window and you can you can get into them so I've been told but um, yeah that's that's the second species that we're going to be targeting is, is a taupe so you know these fish any, can go anywhere from like 10, 10 pound up to well the record's 82 but you, I, I guess a general stamp of fish is probably 25, 30 pound so you know great fun particularly in a kayak proper they've got teeth they're the biggest of the hound species of fish so the biggest out of all the smooth hounds um, spur dogs um, yeah they're they are the biggest ones before you get into the proper proper sharks so yeah be uh, be quite good so that's the second species we're going to be targeting hi guys welcome back to target fishing um, the third species that I'm going to target this year in 2020 is going to be the common skate now we targeted these back in 2019 when we had uh, went up to Scotland just below below Oban in the Highlands a place called Crillon uh, we had a week up there but we was only able to get out on the skate grounds for six hours of course you know I managed to winkle one out but the other boys didn't but it was it was a tiddler so um, this year we're planning to go again we've got the cottage booked in May this year so we're gonna have a week up there and we're gonna be targeting these prehistoric monsters of the deep uh, which go to anywhere up to 200 pound and maybe 200 pound plus and to get something like that on a kayak is gonna be yeah it's gonna be a bit uh, be breathtaking really you know if you can get it off the bottom and get it up but you yeah, would like to have a go like to have a go and um, we are gonna we are gonna sort of set our stall out and just um, if the weather's good we will be just sitting on the skate grounds and just uh, yeah in the hope that uh, we can hook up with a few uh, probably won't land them all if we do hook up with some but yeah that's that's another target species so we got taupe turbot and uh, the common skate so far this year that's the three a um, couple more uh, the fourth one being I think is going to be um, pollock you know your pollock are easy to catch you know they're not hard to catch at all if you can find pollock grounds you can catch them but to, to actually get a decent one like a proper one you know we probably might be able to do that in Scotland as well so that would be a good thing but you know if we can't do it there then we'll do it in the West Country there's there's kayakers that get double figure pollock regularly down that way and that would be my my goal a pollock above 10 pounds so you know if we can do that in the Highlands all well and good uh, if we can't then we'll you know we will we'll be venturing down to the West Country to target other species those big hard fighting pollock from from the kayak and hopefully land a few that'd be great um, the fifth species freshwater one you know I really really want a decent perch you know I had like a little bit of luck this year with a couple of fish over like a pound and a half but yeah I think I think a fish north of sort of two and a half pound is you know it's a good perch and I just a little bit addicted to them really I, I love I love fishing for them because they are so aggressive and you know when they're on they're on and when when they're not you're scratching your head and trying to find ways to to get these fish to switch on and feed and you know sometimes racking your brains and it's very very frustrating and other days you for no rhyme or reason you can just get into get into them but um, I've never ever caught a really big one and I'd, I'd love to do that I'd love to do that so like a 40 centimeter plus perch would be uh, another one of my um, targets for this year um, yeah that's about it so you know watch this space we're going to be doing other videos as well but um, they're the five targets for the year so we've got turbot taupe common skate a pollock above 10 pound and a perch 
north of 40 centimeters so there's like five five species i've got there so we'll do a video on each um and we'll see how close we get to them. i mean it might be a video of of just me actually targeting them and not not getting into them but i'd like to think that we can um tick most of those off this year if we're lucky but we'll see so stay safe guys thanks for tuning in and um yeah like and subscribe and share uh, target fishing catch you soon